So here's proof that I am looking for some indoor shoes other than my handmade former runner indoor shoes. So I tried on a couple of pairs already, but I mean, I'm not going to spend more than $10, that's for sure. Therefore, my options are a little bit limited. And this isn't exactly a high-end store, so I'm also not going to buy something that's a piece of crap. A piece of plastic. So, I don't know. I found some male slip-on ones over here, I'll show you. I think they're nice, actually. Oh, these are lady ones. I don't think these will be that comfortable, though. There's these ones here, though, that I thought could be good. These are the ones I tried on. What do you think? All the women have heels on theirs. I'm afraid they'll stretch out and then they're just going to fly off. And they'll probably smell anyways. And they're going to get wet. Like if I'm in the kitchen and I spill something, it happens. I don't know. I'm going to keep looking. He's kind of cool, but probably not very comfortable. <sighs> and this isn't even the reason I came here. I'm looking for a white shower curtain. I don't really like shopping that much. That's why this is a little frustrating. Uh, the sandals are all on sale this week, so it's a good motivation for me to buy some now. Hmm. Alright, so I'm leaving without shoes, and hopefully without any foot fungus either, because I was trying them on without any socks. Yeah. Oh, but they're on sale, 30% off. Still don't know. Look how ugly they are. But they're the most comfortable ones I tried on. And they're the most expensive. So why is it wherever I vlog in the store there's this ma these massive fans that are really noisy? In case you didn't notice in the shoe section. Which was a completely futile uh, Joanne, stop, call three, three, four, by the please. way. Joanne, call three, three, four. I didn't buy any. I'm ticked. I'm ticked right now. So, I'm ticked not because I didn't find any, but because I even waste the time looking. That's what ticks me off. So I'm here to get um, a shower curtain. I like to get the ones that are like washable. Oh, like this one. Ooh, it's even white. 20 bucks. Yeah, but they last forever. Is this the one? Mm hmm. Hopefully they have one that's in package. Is it right here? Fabric liner. It's polyester, so that's better than vinyl, I think. Um, still made of plastic, but I'm pretty sure this one's better. And you can wash it, hang it on the line to dry. No, I'm gonna call line 101. Oh. Go to line 101. No peace, no peace. So, anyways, I'm gonna pick this up. 14 smacks, and uh, oh, I think Jeff also wanted a steering wheel cover. Hopefully, I can find one here. That way, your steering wheel doesn't get like worn out when you're driving. Jeff seems, seems to think he'll wear it out. He's got rough hands. I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna. Sweet. This is what I'm talking about. Look at pink hearts. Not. All right. <sighs> Leather, I guess, is the best. Or the best bet, right? Leather. Ew. Sick. My pet peeve are things that are meant to look real, but they're not real. Like fake wood and fake leather. This is fake leather. Sick. And this is vinyl wood. Ugh. So anyways, I don't even like any of these and I might have to go to Canadian Tire instead. This is alright, but Jeff will not like that. At least it grips better. We'll see. So, what's frustrating to me about shopping? spending probably 25 minutes in here. Only really needed three things. Only needed two things. Sandals weren't an afterthought. But I'm only leaving with one item. And I feel like I wasted time. And I hate feeling like I wasted time. <sighs> What's going on? Sups. What's for sups? What? Uh, peas, corn, broccoli, parmesan, rebaked potatoes, and roast. Ah! Oh! And cat hair. Sick. That's you, me ten. That's your fault. And what do I got? I got corn, 
Same thing. <laughs> Same thing. It's awesome. I'm squinting because it's bright out. A little camera shake there. Yeah. Mm, that's good like the potatoes like that. Good stuff. Awesome! What's Jenny doing? Ah. So, uh, we're off to... Drive. Drive, take a little drive, maybe get an ice cream. I had to shave my beard. The Paul Bunyan and me. You don't get me, an ice cream every day. Oh, that's why there was hair in the sink. The Paul Bunyan and me was starting to come out, so I trimmed Transfer up a little bit. Transfer complete. Transfer complete. Oh, there's a fly in the van. In the car. <laughs> it's not a van. It's not even a truck. Get out of here. On your way. On your way with you. Did he leave? No. I don't think he did. Because why? Because it's so spacious in here. Because <laughs> he's outside. <laughs> Get out. Cast one. He He's gone, that little bee. He wasn't a bee. <laughs> he wanted to be a bee. Bee. I want a bee. <laughs> I'm a bee. Mm. So I'm watering our grass. The plow did that. The plow did that this winter. It backed right on to our front lawn. So. Now I'm planting grass. The The city actually sent people to fix it, but they don't plant the grass, they just put the soil. And actually when Ben was here, he had planted grass um, for us, but uh, I never watered it, so I don't think it took very well. <laughs> Anyways, I added some more seed. Wild rose bushes, like that one. Wanna know why they're wild? Because they grow all over the lawn without permission. Look at this. See all those little tiny, it's a little dark I know, but see all those little tiny lighter green plants? Those are rose bushes growing all over the lawn. It'd be fine if there's any other plant, I'd just mow it up, which I do, I just mow right over these, but rose bushes have thorns. Mm -hmm.